12 seconds later. Bingo! I apologize. I apologize. My bad. The mega church is officially open. The mega church is open. The mega church of Correct. Wait, we're in the middle of prayer! You can't interrupt the prayer, man. Come on. In the mega church. I've got to carry it. All right. My wallet. Quit. Disrespectful. I don't see the mega church of Queen. Queen? Please, please, please! There is no mega church of Queen. There is only the mega church of Katakuri. Marco doesn't have a goddamn mega church, but Katakuri does. Ben Beckman is a beast, he's a legend. He does not have a mega church. He does not. Maybe a few flyers here or there for a minor church for Beckman. That's it. Katakuri has a mega church. When you tie with the main character and let him walk away and you're still chilling, talking to your little sis, you deserve a mega church. When your character is that good to where you're one of the best characters in One Piece from a character standpoint, you deserve a mega church. All right. So, that being said, ladies and Jen, Atoll, men, boys and girls, children of all ages. What is up? What is good? The King of Lightning here today bringing you guys and gals one piece. The One Piece Wall, Chapter 947, Queen's Gamble. So what does that mean? That means that Queen is active. Queen is inbound. Last chapter, Queen got the Mario treatment, and he was thrown to the side. <laughs> Here we go! And then that was it. But Queen's a Zoan. And I said before that Queen can recover. So, this next chapter, that's a fast recovery rate. We have Brooke and a bunch of seagulls. Oh, and the cat thing from Alabasta. Brooke conducting a choir of seagulls on the Sunny's deck. Let's just go into this chapter. Let's see what Oda has for us this week. Uh, a blast from the past. We saw one of those slave collars explode earlier. That thing is really dangerous. Is this... This is the human Rayleigh. Last chapter, Luffy moved the cuffs. Wait, this could be like super. Hold on. Uh, Rayleigh has his uh, hands over the collar. Don't worry, it'll be okay. Just stay still for me. And it continues to beep. Rayleigh, wah. Happy feet. Armament hard. Willy wah. Armament hockey hardening. He grabs the collar, crush. Luffy sees that, stunned, and then he throws it to the side. Willy, 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 Yo, wait a minute. This is page one? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Where's page one? Right now, I'm thinking this is a very, very important page. 
if we're seeing this in a flashback and Luffy is now seeing the armor hockey hardening, thinking back to it, that kind of confirms the notion that, and, and I'm not saying, okay, 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 hold on, wait, wait, okay. This potentially confirm, put this potentially confirms the notion that Luffy couldn't see armor hockey hardening pre time skip, therefore we couldn't see it. But now that we're seeing it in a flashback, it's because he knows about it now. So when he recalls it, he can now kind of see it. Maybe. That's what I'm getting right now. He grabs it and he throws it. I'm not seeing like his aura go around the change or something. He just grabs it and yeah, crush and throws it. Because I think this does more for the story than what folks would think. But I could be going overboard. So here we go. That ability is the same one that Rayleigh used back then. All right, so here we have your... <laughs> Look at this dude. <laughs> Yogoro forcing the issue, abusing the Zenkai, but I only used it out of desperation. I don't know how I did it at all. Straw Hat Man, that ability you used, it was vastly superior than our Ryuyo. Wait, what? That I've had been trying to teach you. So. Nice. Okay, so if the Ryuyo is simply expanding your hockey onto an object, because Shogoro said that normally it's used for weapons, then is this advanced stage two or something? Did Luffy just skip a level or something? Like, because he trained Rayleigh? Yeah, I... mm. If you can use that, then you should be able to stop her in her tracks. Deflect that monstrous woman's fist. Show me that you are capable of saving our lives. So Big Mom cocking back. And here we have, uh, oh, Henchman. Is he going to try and fight her head on? That's ridiculous. He must be an idiot. I don't need to use strength. The hockey just has to flow through my hands. Big Mom, does he change from a fist to a palm strike? Give me all you got. Combo, combo. Oda, wait a minute. Big Mom, I'm seeing follow through. Yeah. Wait a minute, Big Mom, okay, next page. Big Mom's looking clean. Luffy blasted, Shogoro blasted, Henchman shot, Chopper, Chopper Mon, Okiku, Sir Luffy Taro, Luffy! Their heads stuck in the wall? Legs out, twitching? I knew it, Henchman! Big Mom is looking- Mama, mama. So Focus. Big. Respect. Yon. Co. Respect. Yon. Co. Oda. Good move. Good move this well well done it's your oda well done well done the last chapter i was deathly afraid because shogoro huh, just because i say so kid defend me nani defend me protect my life from the big <laughs> big mom get the yeah <laughs> Too much torque. Way too much torque. Just get to... Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Yeah! Look at that fall, man. Look at that. Look at that. God damn. That's what I'm talking about, man. God damn. This was good. This was actually very good. Well done. Well done. All right, just set him up. Set him up. Knock him down. down. Keep him coming. Sexy boy. That's what I'm talking about, bro. I'm just a sexy boy. Sexy boy. Huh? I'm not your boy toy. Boy toy. She's not your boy toy, man. She's not. Well done, Oda. Well done. If you're gonna have them bloom, I get it. Extreme situations. I'm fine. Usopp, you can say bloomed. Bingo! Bingo! 
You can say that Usopp bloomed in Dress Rosa to try and save Luffy. Extreme situation, all or nothing, but it was unexpected. You don't plan for that. <laughs> Luffy had to get his ass murked by 10 hours of Katakuri. <laughs> if your girl can set it up, there's a difference between Goku getting destroyed when Ginyu took over his body, going into a freaking healing pod, and coming out stronger through that means, rather than Vegeta. Hey, Krillin! Where's Krillin? Hey, you! Human! Shoot me! But I can't! Do it! Do you not see? Frieza's getting stronger! Don't abuse the system! Oda didn't go too far, and I greatly appreciate that. Blah! Luffy, wah, sorry Gramps, I failed. You learn from your failures and you will get stronger. Don't die on me, pull, and he pulls out Gramps. Is, is Hilgoro's head stretching? What the hell? Jesus. I know there was two gum gum no me's, oh, okay. Gramps, alive, big swollen part of his forehead. I use Ryo to guard myself just, okay, so he used hockey. Wait a minute, but you said that you are going to die. Can we go back there for- He said that he was going to die. Look, I'm not saying that Hyogoro should have died because he's too important to the story, for at least for Wano Kuni. Alright, fine. But, yeah, like, he straight trolling. So you're still alive. Unforgivable. How dare you eat the Oshiruko that was meant for everyone. Big Mom, still just not. Nah. I am only able to teach you cough. How to gather the vast amount of Ryo known to you as hockey that surrounds your body. Hey, don't talk, you'll die. In order to don invisible armor. And yeah, he has armor hockey harding as he's doing that. Or at least as, as he says that. In order to don invisible armor, it is a powerful ability that can be used defensively just as well as it can be used offensively. But there is another step further than that. It allows the user to transform, to, to transfer the gathered hockey into the enemy's body and destroy them from the inside. So you have arm hockey hardening, and then you have in order to don invisible armor. So he's talking about invisible armor at first. And the invisible armor, the invisible armor, a powerful ability that can be used defensively as well as offensive. Wait a minute. So is he implying that what Sento Maru did and what Mary Gold did is different than what Rayleigh could do? Is that what he's implying? There's another step further than that. It allows the user to transfer the gathered hockey into the enemy's body. This is getting interesting. That steel collar, you shattered it from the inside out using hockey. So you have already achieved it. You have already learned how to utilize the large amount of hockey surrounding your body. You have simply yet to release it. Then Hyogoro passes out. Gramps! Then Big Mom, yeah, cocking back from the punch. Unforgivable punch. Whoa, how the hell you- <laughs> Do you have any idea how fast I am? Of course, smash. Good luck, Straw Hat Man. Okay, so Hyogoro, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna die, no! Good luck. Good luck, kid. Peace out. Don't go in the wind. All right, so this whole thing has been troll. At least when it comes to your girl's death, comedy. It's all comedy. Next page. Udon Prisoner, Iron Factory. Why won't they pick up? That's because the boss pawn snail has disappeared. It's been smothered. Okay, that's definitely not good. But more importantly, what are those earthquakes? We see a prisoner with crazy hair. Is that hair or is that a hat? And that smile is creepy. Yakuza boss. Yakuza boss, clearly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yakuza boss. All right. Stop right there. Whoa. What the? When? Whoa. When the hell did Big Mom grab this? Big Mom has a weapon. Not Napoleon. Because he's still asleep. But Mihawk, watch out. And we have the henchmen. B Big Mom. And they're just stunned. No way. She broke through the door and entered the iron factory where that guy was. This is bad. The blast furnace is in there. Everyone's panicking. What should we do? Even Master Queen was taken out. There's no way you can stop her. Wano is Kaido's territory. Old Maid, Babanuki. Oh, turns around. Queen, bruised up, still smoking. Okay, so Queen recovered. Zoans, it is what is there. Master Queen, I won't let that old hag get her away. I have a plan, everyone. 
Listen closely because we only have one shot. So, roll credits? Roll credits, okay. So what's the play? I want you to think of Big Mom as a board. If she keeps charging forward, she'll eventually end up here once again. Okay, so she's running in a circle around the prisoner mine area, chasing Luffy as he runs around. And Big Mom continues to chase Luffy, wielding the weapon. Essentially, she's causing some devastation. We pan outside the prisoner mines and we see an explosion. She's back, Master Queen. Queen is in hybrid form? Wait a minute, what? Hold on. No. No. Queen just... No, never mind. I was wrong. Where the hell's Queen? Queen... Okay, so Big Mom is still chasing Luffy. She continues to smash. So, this has been going on for a minute. Queen, what is that position? That is too much mass. You had my, you had my curiosity! Now you have my attention. But now Queen has my attention. Now Queen has my attention. Wait a minute. Umbra. Fun fact. A Brachiosaurus can weigh up to 30 to 80 tons. To be fair, Mach Vice weighed more with his ability. <laughs> but that's still a lot of mass. That's a lot of dinosaur. Oh no. Wait, did he jump? Oh no, why is he jump? No, there's too much. I mean, in theory, Big Mom should be fine, but I, given her nerfed state right now, I'm not too sure. Uh, unless he has an attack of some kind plan. Like, okay, well, let me, 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 let me. Wait a minute. That was one. Yeah. Umbra, of course. Arabian Night. Arabian More often than not. So Queen, I think, is getting some hang time in Brontosaurus form. And they're looking at Queen. I think Queen is coming inbound. I'll talk big about Oshiruko. There's a part of Oshiruko. Queen, does he, like, transform somewhat in midair above Big Mom? But then Oshiruko, empty, Big Mom throws the pot. I think Queen is transforming above Big Mom. Big Mom looks up now. No, okay, he didn't transfer. Whoa. That neck game. Queen. Oh, goddamn. Brachio Bomber. Kanji reads Hoodlum Bomb. <laughs> Hoodlum Bomb. The ground beneath Big Mom starts to break in. And here we have a. Uh, Baba Nu. Oh! Queen! Queen! Wait a minute, Queen! Nice. Yeah, hold on. He did it! It's a direct hit! Long live Master Queen! He Whoa! Wait, my wallet with a link. Is it porn? It's YouTube. That's that's yeah, okay. You've <laughs> my wallet redeemed himself. He, <laughs> he redeemed himself. Yeah, that's well. Yes, he is. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah, he is. You goddamn right, he is. 
Across the ring, bro. Oh, my God. <laughs> Unforgiven sounds. He also dropped the 100. Long me needed for those cheeks. Yo, stop. Big mo hmm. Again, I still don't understand why pound. <sighs> With two kids? Turn her around, and that is how Kaido made Charles Barkley. <laughs> no. Ka hashtag Kaido long stroke big mom. Hashtag Katakuri. That's disrespectful. How you put a Katakuri prayer next to Kaido long stroke big mom? Back to the chapter, bro. Okay. A big mom, I think, should be feeling this because she's nerfed. If big mom was in her not nerfed state, arm hockey hardening, done. We're clean. Big Mom, headbutted by Queen. Big Mom sweating a bit. But um, Mama, Mom, wait, what the hell? Pero Sparrow Smoothie. Die Oh no. No, God, please, no. 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 Ah, Big Mom opens her eyes. Open your mind, Big Mom. My head hurts. So Queen did damage Big Mom. My head hurts. What am I doing? All right. I fell into the ocean. I got separated from everyone, and then I went to some filthy town. Next page. That's right. I remember everything now. Queen, hey, you're kidding me, right? Why won't you go down, old hag? Oh. What is with this panel? Yo, welcome back to the big bitch. Welcome back to the big bitch. Welcome to my world. Oh, you're from Kaido's crew. Queen, right? Queen. <laughs> Dude. It's over. No freaking way. No freaking way. She's a monster. Her aura is completely different from before. What happened to her? Yo, henchman. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're dead. We're dead. Nice. What? Thud? Snore? Next page, hold on. Bring me some pure sea stone chains, wrap them around her 100 times, and even give her 100 shots of the anesthesia that we use on wild beasts. Yes, sir. Is the ship ready yet? Yes.
massage. Okay. So. Let me just digest this for another second or two. I can't even formulate the words properly right now. Big Mom You know what? Okay. Okay. I see what Oda's doing here. Big Mom from the... Oh, okay, 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 okay. If I remember how this all played out in the first place. You know what? Look, chapter, 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 chapter. Is the ship ready? Yes. A small handful of guards can stay behind to hold down the fort. Everyone else get on the ship. If this monster wakes up, we're dead. Every second counts. We're taking Big Mom to Onigashima with maximum security. Understood, sir. She destroyed all the gates, seal off Udon using the emergency backup gates, throw all the prisoners back into their cells, and clean up the, this mess. Oh, maid, Udon is in your hands. I won't let you down, but what about that guy? We're leaving. And I'm pretty sure he means Luffy. Maybe Kid, but I doubt it. Our destination is Onigashima, and so we see we see a bunch of pigs, a bunch of boars. We see Big Mom, literally like, a mound of sea stone on Big Mom's body. Queen is back in his goddamn stroller, all right, in his goddamn uh, electric chair, transversing Walmart, board the ship, hurry up, set sail, full speed ahead, Queen ship, Onigashima. Momo, the gate is closing. Hmm? It cannot be helped. We promised that we would wait here. Let's go, huh? Let's go, let's go where? Inside? Are the gates closed? We've sealed them shut. Do we have any communications yet? We still can't get a signal. Udon is fully cut from the outside world. What if something happens? We won't be able to tell a soul. Then I guess I can go wild. Monkey D, monkey D, monkey D. Monkey D. Luffy. I guess I can go out now, huh? Huh? Yeah, huh? Go out. Yes, of course. Who said that? It'd be pretty boring now that Big Mom and the balloon are gone, but... Oh, that's right. He's free now. Old May, not even sweating Luffy, apparently. I've always been free. Is that like symbolic? Like, Luffy, I'll be the freest guy in the ocean? Free? I guess so. I'll be taking over Udo now. The counterattack has finally begun. Big Mom is gone. Queen is gone. Chapters end. Okay. I can't get too upset you more if I you more if I you more I can't get too upset because from the very beginning 
when Big Mom first lost her memories, I called that Big Mom was going to be a plot device. In some way, shape, or form, this was going to benefit Luffy. Big Mom, because of Queen, has now regained her memories, but then pulls like a garp or an ace, passes out, because I guess the mental shock of her regaining her memories makes her fall asleep. Oda, I guess that makes sense. You more gray gray fighting You more gray gray fighting So. Queen's attack, I think, did virtually no damage, aside from the amount of force needed to regain her memories? Or did some damage? Whatever. And in the process, while Big Mom is there terrorizing Udon, we still don't know why. If I ever see you, I'm gonna Listen. slit your hey. face wide open, yeah? We still don't know why Chopper decided not to wait for Raizo's orders and go right into Udon with Big Mom in tow. And niggas want to give Chopper credit for all of Big Mom's work, which almost put Luffy's life on the line, but at the same time was beneficial because Luffy was training! And, not only does her existence free up Kid and Killer from their predicament, frees Luffy from his current predicament, and then busts down the gates to all the other areas in Udon, which Luffy will now proceed to take over because there just so happens to be a Yakuza force, five Yakuza bosses in Udon. But now, we have Queen not killing Big Mom off the rip. Okay, fine. It's a shonen. Whatever. I guess don't throw Big Mom to the ocean. Whatever. All right, fine. Bring Queen and Big Mom over to Kaido. This removes Queen from Udon. Luffy's now as free as a bird. Old Maid's going to get washed. And when we have Big Mom and Kaido meet, guess what? Rocks. Big Mom, as shocking as it sounds, has served her purpose for Luffy's benefit clearly. Right now, the major antagonist of this arc is quote-unquote Kaido, and I use quotes very loosely there. Big Mom, being in the fray, kind of throws a monkey wrench into things, especially when you have Luffy saying time and time again, after Kaido is defeated, Big Mom, you're next. Big Mom is after Kaido. That's how it has to roll, unless we want to take Luffy's words seriously. So, Big Mom is here. She's served her purpose for now. Get out of the picture. And how do you get Big Mom out of the picture? Make her fall asleep. She regained her memories, too. So all that stuff about how Big Mom is gonna, Big Mom is going to remember the caramel now. False, wrong. I told you guys. For the folks that are so gung ho on another caramel, she. It's not that she forgot. It's not repressed. She never saw what happened in the first place. In order for her to find that out, she has to either talk to Strusen or talk to who? The giants. And where are the giants? In Elbath. 